Hi Gemini, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back. Welcome to new pe viewers and please sub and like and hit the bell on all and when you have done that set your settings in YouTube, uh, give YouTube permi permission and also in your mobile device. Then you'll get no notified when I go live or when new videos are uploaded. I'm using a new deck this week and it's called the Star Terror and I've made a review on this deck. It's vibrant and beautiful. It's gorgeous. And we need a little bit of brightness in these dark days but I'm really looking forward to Halloween and I hope you like the videos of making pumpkin soup and the pumpkin light for Halloween. And there will be lots of different interviews with regards to the uh, Witches UK series. There is also a reflexologist coming and I'm going to talk to Tracy again more about safety and hazards of uh, candles and what you should watch out for as the Witches series is also mainly about the environment and to bring yourself back in to your strength and taking care of yourself. So let's get started with your reading for the 12th to the 18th of October and you're coming in beautifully you're coming in with the nine of cups so a wish is coming true an ending to difficulties and a new beginning there is going to be peace look at that dove I love it the dove is holding the heart in its beak and caressing the heart so perhaps you might m meet a new partner if that is your wish or a new job or a new beginning of any kind beautiful you will be able to do something that you've been waiting for something is coming to fruition there's a new beginning look at the rainbow whoa the rainbow means that the angels have heard you, the divine has heard you and your ancestors or loved ones up in heaven as heaven and earth are connected and you've got the eight of cups you're ready for this new beginning big time really 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 you want excitement, you want adventure well it's coming, it's coming you're going up from an eight to a nine okay then you have um, the Emperor and you could be meeting up with an Aries but you could be also seeking advice about this new beginning um, perhaps you've been planning something and now your plans are coming to fruition as you have the two of wands you could be partnering up romantically or in business and you will be seeking advice from a professional or a father figure okay the Emperor is a lot like the Hierophant so he's the head of his countries okay the Emperor is bigger and uh, in status than the Kings so you are definitely up there with the hobnobs <laughs> perhaps that is what you wanted to do business with the uh, uh, what you call it, the uh, high uh, uh, workers, um, the hopnobs, the big companies, you might have recognition and you need advice on how to deal with these big companies so that you they won't pull you on all sides uh, okay, make sure those plans of yours are as sound as a pound as they say okay good things are happening if you are in legal situations then this could be your advocate um, getting your justice perhaps that is what you've been wishing for well there is a new beginning your plans you've been waiting steadily and slowly and quietly and you've been making plans for this new uh, beginning when justice is done well not only have you got the two of ones, you've got the ace of ones. New beginnings, new passion. Passion can be a hobby, but a hobby can become work. Perhaps a new job. 
perhaps a new passion physically and mentally with an Aries, a Leo or a Sagittarius and we've already got Aries on the table beautiful perhaps it could be a new job in spiritualism why? because um, we have uh, um, the moon here and the moon means uh, you could be a psychic or a medium or you could be wishing to be one and you want to be professional perhaps you sought advice on how to set up the business and you've been planning this well the start is here now but you could also be meeting a Pisces and a lot of Piscearians um, uh, are mediums and psychics they're very sensitive because they're water the element water so don't exclude Cancer or Scorpio either you've got the two pillars here and that resembles 11 so the angels are giving you a doorway to step through the new beginning is here big time but you have to be able to see this new beginning be careful how you go about it though perhaps you have to uh, s seek advice on how to go forwards like I said but you have to talk to these big companies or these partners but make sure you watch your intonation and what you say because the five swords means arguments war competition disagreements okay so tread carefully but don't be walked over that is what I'm saying stand your ground talk clearly like the swords clearly um, like the air signs they can sell uh, ice cubes to Eskimos be the good sales pitch have your pitch prepared um, plan your pitch sell yourself so you can stand strong though so there won't be any arguments if there are no disagreements or arguments with anybody or anything uh, at the moment and this is a warning watch out if you're forming partnerships because you've got the two of cups and that's also your soulmate so you could be partnering up in love or in business but be careful how you bring messages across be the salesperson that is what I'm hearing S be the one that's selling ice cubes to your Eskimo don't let them talk you under the table or down okay stand up for yourself if they start provoking you and want an argument walk away rise above it and say when you've calmed down then I will talk to you but I don't want to argue with you you are my partner and I want to keep this partnership because we're soulmates we are a lot alike okay especially with an air with a fire sign they can be very forceful so be warned if oxygen you are oxygen you are air you you will the fire um, burns quicker and larger so be careful don't don't go into their provocative manners now always accompany it always accompany it Accompanied. Sometimes English is really difficult. Do you know that you are loved by a benevolent source, one who knows you and cares for you without revelation or re reservation? The divine is showing up for you in various forms, no matter where you find yourself. It may occur in the form of a sharing fondness with faithful friends or in any of the various other diverse, diversified forms of all life such as you ask ah a king side dragonfly darting along around you or sunshine lighting up a crude pathway through the dense forest or an encouraging word from a stranger at that moment you need it most remove the lenses of indifference and disbelief as you open yourself to seeing more 
than meets the eye and I was just talking to you you might be more spiritual so you can see perhaps more than others can you will notice the amazing abundance of signs affirming your direction step into the wonderment and behold yourself embraced by the divine so you that is beautiful spread your wings when I see this card is spread your wings you're beautiful you can do it your plans can come to fruition with the right advice stand strong be the Emperor of your own kingdom the angel um, card is balance pause step back pause and think things through carefully before you ta take action and start arguing that's what I said rise above it keep your balance maintain your balance I hope you have enjoyed this reading Gemini I certainly have take heed of the warnings and your wish will come true believe in it have faith okay let me know what you think of this reading and what you're hoping for or what you're wishing for take care my darlings and stay safe be blessed and please subscribe and share ciao ciao